Greetings friends, Dragon here once again. If it's your first time finding my channel, then do please consider clicking that red button and subscribing. Okay, just a quick unboxing and a little bit of uh, subscriber stroke friend mail today. Um, I got this through, which I know what it is. And um, this is from my good friend Andrew at Amphlet Reviews, who's very kindly sent me the booklet for Black Magic because he was not too taken with that movie and he knows I'm a pretty huge Shaw Brothers fanatic. And it's cool to get a booklet for one that I did not have already so thank you so much to him for his generosity that is awesome um, I shall add that very happily to my little we existing release but super generous really kind of him Andrew your star thank you so much man legend and the other one is the big arrow release for this month and um, we've already been covering some of the sales but this is uh, the Daimajin box set a trilogy of crazy kaiju statue coming to life movies with this glorious presentation in a much sturdier box than I was expecting. I thought this was going to be just a kind of full slip style, but it's not. It's a really a completely an enclosed box. So we'll get into it and take a little look because it looks pretty damn cool. Um, arrived pretty well wrapped as our stuff generally tends to do. This was one that I pre-ordered. I've seen the first two. I haven't seen the last one and they're really pretty great movies as well as being pretty entertaining monster movies but the as kind of period samurai films they're they're pretty beautiful they look incredible cinematography is amazing uh, performances are pretty cool they're, the second one and the first one were very similar in terms of subject matter uh, but both really well realized really well acted so i'm intrigued to see the third, and uh, we get our little J card on the back, breaks down our extra features, and then this really nice kind of clouds effect underneath. Very cool. Inside we have the three movies and a book, I think. All with this very cool, so they're slightly slimline cases, but the box is very cool. These little kind of clouds in the back. And then the individual covers that we have for each of the three movies. I think these are all by Ian McEwan. No, I tell a lie, these are all by Matt Frank. Good job, Matt Frank, because these look pretty awesome. So we have that one, we have this one, and this one. And then we get a book, this kind of glorious, kind of woodblock style. Really nice little bound book with articles by Jonathan Clements, uh, who I think does one of the commentaries, uh, Keith Aitken, Ed Godzuski, uh, Raphael Corneli, Eric Homwick, Robin Gatto, and Kevin Derendorf. Um, a few ones to go through. We've got our cast and crew notes for all three movies. And Jonathan Clements article and interspersed with some really nice Kind of photography, but they put this nice sort of aged effect on the side of it. Good job, guys. That's very, very nice. And it feels really cool. The sort of quality of the paper and the quality of the printing's amazing. There are films that I remember being pretty striking for the first two. If you're a fan of Godzilla, Godzilla or or Gamera, um, this will be right up your street. I'm much more of a Godzilla guy than a Gamera guy. Was never quite able to get behind that turtle. But Godzilla, I'm a pretty big fan of. Um, certainly the original Showa and Toho era movies are all really cool. The book's pretty awesome. A lot of text to go through. And if you look the size of the text, pretty small. I know a lot of people have been a bit worried about the fact that the Shaw's book's only going to be 60 pages. But if it's 60 pages with this sort of size text, in the format that it'll be in, then I don't think we need to be worried. I think they can cram an awful lot in. This book is probably coming in at just under 100 pages, 95. Very cool. And then the discs themselves, we get a little card in each one with our original poster art on the back, and then the newly commissioned art on the other side. All the covers are reversible. So we've got Wrath of Dimension, so just so you can see, that's the original poster that they've given us here and then a replication of the artwork on the disc so same for each one original poster art 
on the reversible card. And inside this one, I think we have a poster too. So this, an our teaser card. Again, our little original poster art on the back. I think we'll keep their commissioned artwork because it's really pretty damn cool. And then this is going to be a fold out poster printed on very thin paper. Be careful when you're unfolding that one, guys. With one of the original posters on that side, and then their big cover, and they did for the front of the box on the other side. Incredibly cool. And this I managed to pick up pretty reasonably. Um, I think I'd used the previous sale code from the Easter sale when I did my pre order. Um, and I already had some reward points that it was pretty affordable. I think the whole set was about £40, including shipping, which is a bit of a bargain for three pretty great movies in such a glorious looking box. So, yeah, good job. Um, review this to follow if anybody wants to know more about the movies. Let me know. Johnny from the future here just noticed that before I forgot to show you the back, which is a slightly different image. Equally cool. This one, a repeat of the one that we get on here, um, but the front image is totally original and not on any of the other movie boxes. Cool. Cheers. But if is this one that you guys went for, um, jump into the comments below and let me know if you held off or if it's one that you're thinking of getting. If you want to see a review, all that good stuff, let's just have a chat. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Cheers.